right guys it's easter sunday i hope you guys have been having a blessed weekend so i'm gonna be heading to a friend's house we're cooking dinner today so i made the size and i have my portion of what i'm gonna bring so the girls took the liberty of purchasing each other some things to make their easter basket so they're gonna go ahead and reveal that to each other now so one second y'all got your stuff so carrie do you have your basket where is it? Go get yours first, Carrie. Oh, it's so cute. Thank you. You're welcome. This is her basket that she gave me. Here you go. Let me see. Go ahead, Tom. Take your stuff out. Okay. Okay, so it's the frog basket. She got me a, she got me a cup. I've been wanting, I've been actually wanting me a cup like this. This is so cute, and then it's pink, my favorite color. So here. And then she got me a teddy bear. So cute. Let me see. It's a little cow. And then she got me a perfume. I got me a whole, this going into my collection. Ew. <laughs> I don't know. I can't wait to smell that. And then, what's this? Lip oil. And then I also got some mascara. So cute. Good job, Carrie. Thank you. So cute. All right, Kitana, you can go get Carrie's gift so she can see what you got her as well. Okay, so I'm going to get Carrie's gift now. Be right back. Look who's that. What did you get, Dior? <laughs> Dior, excuse me. <laughs> Carrie to get her gift. Come on, Tana. Yep. Yeah, you can look. Hello Kitty minifigure. Mm. And some gum, watermelon. Okay. And this Korean drink, strawberry. <laughs> And some Hello Kitty noodles. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. Oh, some coffee. It's a new flavor. I don't know how really? it tastes. Yeah. Dragon mm -hmm. Sweet Chili. Mm hmm. Wow. And the drip wrap. I picked that out. You did? <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> what else you got? Yeah, we just looked at some Pockies. Some Pockies. Have, no, have you ever had that flavor? Oh, Pockies. Mm mm. Well, that's yeah. good. Okay. Mm -hmm. Thank you, honey. You're welcome. Oh, y'all so sweet. Yeah. It's a new vlog. It is April 1st. I'm about to get my nails done. You guys know I chopped them off in the last vlog so I could braid the girl's hair. I have my friend, she's a traveling nail tech out here in Dallas. She's here to do my nails at my home. Hey, I got it like that, but hey. Go ahead and introduce yourself. Hello, I'm Time of Time Gem Nails. You can find me on Instagram, Time Gem Nails, one word. Um, I'm available to be booked anywhere in the DFW, Dallas, Fort Worth, metropolitan area. So if you're here, you want your nails done, call your girl up. Hey, let's get started. Uh So 
know I had um, went and got my aunt. She's not my blood aunt, mm -hmm. but she's like my aunt. Right. Her um, brother and my grandmother was together for many years, but they just never got married, right? Mm -hmm. So we always be talking on the phone and stuff. Mind you, she's 81 years old. So we always be talking on the phone and stuff. She'd be telling me, you know, people's doing her wrong. The nursing aides beating her up, knocked her down, what? messed up her hip. And I'm like, what? They did that? Who did what? And then she's <laughs> like, the person in the apartment complex that she lives in, it's a, um, one of those high rises mm -hmm. for older people. The manager, she had went downstairs and told the manager that she didn't like the apartment she was in, right? Because they moved her to this apartment on the third floor. She used to live on the second floor. Right. So they moved her to the apartment on the third floor because now she's in a wheelchair. So they were trying to make everything handicapped accessible, yeah. right? Yeah. They told her that the apartment had been remodeled and everything. She got up there, she said, got old carpets. It's not a good apartment. She doesn't like it. She wants to go back to her old one. You know what I'm saying? So right. I'm like, well, why did they even move you? She said, my doctor told them that they had to move me to something that was more accessible because I'm in a wheelchair now. So I was like, all right. But she's like, I don't like this apartment. It has a bad feeling in here and all mm -hmm. that. So I'm like, probably somebody died in that apartment. Right. You know, because this is a, <laughs> a place for old people. Yeah, spirit so is people, lingering. Yeah, people are always dying in mm -hmm. those apartments. So, um... She said she went to go complain to the manager, and she was like, you know, can I talk to you? Excuse me, can I talk to you? Mind you, she's in a wheelchair. Right. So she's looking up. To, this is how she, I'm imagining it while she's right. telling me. She then rolled over to go tell her, go tell the manager about yeah. the apartment. And she said, she said, excuse me, can I um, talk to you? So she was talking to the manager, and she was telling about the apartment, how she doesn't like it or whatever. And then some lady came and interrupted them. Mm -hmm. So she, she was just sitting there. She said, I'm just sitting here like a little kid. They treat me like a little kid, like I'm not even there. And I said, mm -hmm. what? And so she said, you know, she was like, excuse me. Um, and the lady looked down at her and said, oh, I would just stop, said her name, and said, right. I would just uh, shut up about that. And I said, oh, she did what? Oh, wow. She did what? She's an 81-year-old. So this is like all happening at the end of November, right? Mm -hmm. Let me tell you how long you are. Shorter? Yeah. That's good? That's good. Let me see. Yeah, because you're going to be doing a little tip, so it makes sense. It mm -hmm. yeah. you, that's good? Yeah. We're going to file a little bit too, so. Yeah. Okay. No, it's good. So okay. you have more mm -hmm. So, girl, this is like the end of November. Mind you, she called me and said, I don't have anything to eat for Thanksgiving. I called my son, and he put his girlfriend on the phone, and I said, can you guys bring me a plate of food? Mm -hmm. And the girlfriend said, supposedly, now, <laughs> yeah, this will make sense later on. Yeah. I'm just thinking everybody's being mean. Nobody's helping. Right. Me. The girlfriend says, oh, we only have enough food for us in the house. Oh, wow. Who makes one plate of food for everybody for Thanksgiving? Everybody goes back for two, three plates, right? And even if you did only have one plate for everybody, mm -hmm. you could have took a piece of chicken from this plate, a right. pop of collard greens from right. this plate, macaroni from that and plate, made her a little yeah. plate. So that was getting me. I'm like, ooh, mm, mm, these right. are, they ain't helping her. Don't nobody care about it. This is what I'm thinking. I don't even know. Yeah. yeah it would make sense towards the end. But girl, so I'm like, we just got to go and get her. I talked to Julius. Mm -hmm. I told her, well, the only time that we would be able to come and get you is... Christmas break because right. NJ goes with his right. father and we could drive down there. So we're planning for this for a month. Right. You know, I'm telling her she don't got no ID card, she don't got no social security card, she don't got anything because oh, no. supposedly one of the CNAs that was coming there stole her stole her billfold. This was a year ago before Maybe she even was in the hospital. Mm -hmm. She didn't have nothing. <laughs> oh, her wow. teeth, she used to have these really, really pretty false teeth. She said she thinks she accidentally threw them away. So I was like, you know what? I got a lot of stuff I got to get. So right. I made her appointment from down here for up there right. online to get an ID card. So right. she got, went up there, got the temporary, but she didn't get the permanent because they right. never changed the apartments. Remember right. I said she was on the second floor, they moved yeah. to the third floor. So when I sent her for that ID, it must have went to the second like, floor and not the third floor yeah. mailbox. So, but she did have the temporary. Julius and I went up there and got her. Mind you, she has a dog. The dog can't hear it's deaf, it's old. I can't. So we went up there and we're like, we're going to go get her. We're going to go get her. We're telling for a month. Make sure you can get this. Right. And whatever you can't get, I said, don't stress out because we'll figure it out when you come here. Don't, don't stress out. She's so happy. Right. Um, so we went up there and we got her. Mind you, it was a 26 and a half hour ride. 
right? Right. But um, it was longer coming back because she got to stop going to the bathroom. She wears diapers. We got to stop for the dog oh, wow, to go to yeah. the bathroom. It was a lot. <laughs> so, girl, fast forward to... She got dementia. We, we done brought her down here. <laughs> we watching TV. Yeah. She's watching TV. We watching TV. Then all of a sudden, here you go. Mind you, nobody lived upstairs right. for me. Nobody lived on the first floor. She go. They add it again. They run around. I said, what the? <laughs> I, said, I said, no, there's nobody living upstairs and there's nobody that lives downstairs. I said, when we're in, um, we're in Texas, we're not in Rhode Island anymore. Right. And she go, oh, yeah, that's right. I said, yeah, there's nobody upstairs, but you can still see her. Mm-hmm. Oh, my Girl, God. Girl, so I said, out. oh, my God. Right? So, I don't even mm -hmm. know what's going on yet. We got to get her to the doctors and right. everything. Girl, it got worse. Just know I'm going to mind my fucking business. Next right. Time. I'm going to mind my fucking business. <laughs> she was talking on something. There was... Africans on my couch having sex, girl. Oh, wow. I was in the room with my son because I was just like so nervous. I felt so bad for her, you know what I'm saying? Right. But I was nervous for my son because she can't get in his room, but I was just thinking, where there's a will, will there's a way, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? And so I went to live with my son one night. It's like 2.30 in the morning, 3.30 in the morning. She come knocking on his door, go get your mother. And I said, what's wrong? It's me. She said, go get your mother. She thinks she's talking to my son. Right. I said, it's me, what's wrong? So I come to the door. I had a little barrier at right, the door, right. so I moved out the way. And I, right. moved. and I come out the door, she goes, she peeks through the crack. She goes, come out here for me. Mm -hmm. Point into the living room. <laughs> Point into the living room. She goes, there's some Africans having sex on your couch. And, and so, I'm like, I don't talk to, I'm fast forwarding to yeah, this part, right. but I don't talk to the doctors and they're like, just, just play along to get along, right, you know, because right. at first I was saying, I don't right. see nothing. Okay. I, you calling me a liar? You right. calling me a liar? Yes, yeah. he was getting upset. So yeah. I was like, I don't know what to do because I don't want to lie. So the doctor said, just go along with it. Right. So girl, she said, it's too active to have sex on your couch. Uh -huh. And I'm like, what? So I go and look around the corner at the couch. I said, ooh, and they ain't got no shame, huh? And she right. said, I'm telling you. And then she looked around to the couch and said, just nasty. <laughs> like she telling somebody, <laughs> girl. I'm about to go, we fed her. I'm about to go to bed at 10.30. She said, oh, I want, I want a sandwich. I want something. I said, well, what you want? She said, can you make me a fried egg sandwich? I said, yeah. I made her a nice little fried egg sandwich. She just ate a big, big meal at 6.30. Right, right. I ain't mad at it because I like to cook. You want right, to eat it, I like right. to cook. So she had this big old meal, then she wants a little snack. No problem. I have no problem with that. I love her. So I made it. I said, okay, I'm, I'm going to bed now. She said, okay, go ahead, get you some sleep at night. That's always her thing. Go get you some sleep. Mm -hmm. Girl, about 11.45, got me in here starving. Ain't nobody feeding me. So I get up, go to the I said, what's wrong? I'm hungry. I said, you ate breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and I made you the fried egg sandwich at 10.30. I'm hungry. I said, what you want me to do? So I went in there and warmed up some food from the food that we had at 6.30. Bro. She had people thinking I wasn't feeding her. I wasn't right. taking care of her. Wow. Nothing. And then the next day, oh, I love you so much. Thank you for everything that you're doing. You're my Man. favorite. Da, 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 da. And the next awesome. thing, she'd be like, I don't trust you. I'm not taking those pills. Oh. I said, you got to take your pills. I'm not taking those pills. I love them so far. They're so cute. They're not even five. They're not even done yet. If anybody want to know what it is, Valentino Beauty Pure. And it's the soft touch. You can let go. No, I got you hooked real bad. Why you looking at me like that? Just tell me what you want, and I'll give it to you. Just tell me what you need, I'll fulfill it for you. I'll make it feel so nice, make it last your whole life. Oh, oh, oh. You can let it go on a bad, bad. Fuck your status, fuck your, your status. Don't let them 
All right, y'all. So I'm already out at the. Oh my god, <laughs> at the cocktail making class. I am just now getting my camera out of the car because when I got here, I was running a little late, and I ended up leaving the camera in the car. So we're gonna head back in now. So yeah. Um, I didn't really get a chance to show y'all what I got on, but it's a um outfit I've worn before. So. They be doing the most, you know. Extreme most. So anyway, here's what I got on. Guys, I typically don't wear this top with this, but um I was in a rush, like I said. If you guys have to be ordered food or would like to order food, that's what we'll kind of bring it out at that time. Uh, but apart from that, let's just go ahead and kind of jump right into it. Go ahead and pick up these tools. Y'all get comfortable with them. But these tins right in front of you are called the Boston Shaker Tins. Can anybody guess where they're from? Boston. Nah, y'all, they are from Europe. The no way. Oh my god. <laughs> 
we're in the city. Who made that drink? You know, I did. Who made that Very drink? Very last minute, dog. <laughs> it's not sweet at all. It's growing on me the more I drink it, though. <laughs> this shit bitter as hell. At first, I was you like... You know what? Since I add more mint, I hide like it a little bit more. Right. Yeah. <laughs> it's grown on me. I think it's because I'm, I'm feeling the drink. I killed my drink already. Oh, yes, yes, yes. No, no, no. Never enough of that. Oh. You know. Oh, where? Who did that? You know, at home care. <laughs> yes, I didn't have to go to a salon. Yes, darling. <laughs> home services, baby. You know, luxury. <laughs> Shakerton and um, some other little lounge. It has to be like club vibes. This is the first time I've been out in a long yeah, time. Yeah, then like hookah lounges and stuff like that. Oh. We gonna go get some to eat up? Girl, we doing everything. I ain't told. I ain't told Julius nothing about the time we coming home, and he ain't asked. So. <laughs> on red so now they know that they do it i tell them i'm moving units my videos they gon' view it but if i ain't got a lot they really streaming my music yeah. i give bitches the kind they fuck around and lose it now all right girl my ass over here making two drinks <laughs> I just put the me on my bitch. Mine is like 50. Mine was 950. High heels on my tippies. Don't say in Gabbana that on my tippies. Hot me vitamins when I write the dicky. I still got the juice, bitch, by a sippy I will never slippy like a Mickey Stay in your Tory lane, bitch, I'm not Iggy I know that these niggas tryna bang like Chitty I am such a catch, nigga, throwin' your nigga mm. Who wanna play with Nicky? 
Got the power, I could tell my niggas pray like 50 Distribute about a million dollars worth the brickies But when we keep 50, might cut 950 Bitch, yeah. give me more time Give me more time Way too, I ain't ended up again. Bend that ass over, let that coochie breathe. Shake that ass, bitch. Hands all you need, hands all you need, hands all you need. Shake that ass for Drake, now shake that ass for me. Bend that ass over, let that coochie breathe. Shake that ass. Got some love deep inside of me No need to lie to me I know you got a guy He's not a guy to me Just say goodbye to him And take a ride to me Ride to me I still got some love deep inside of me Please drag it out of me You just might Just might get that G-Wagon out of me Please drag it out of me Please drag it out Holy hey. game, petty game Rich baby daddy game I'm with red like I'm at a Cincinnati game Tatter gang, but she tatter name Real bitch held me down before I had a name Heard this money on my head, what is that to me? I put a hundred bands on him, he put a rap on me We from two different worlds, but it's a match to me To bend it over, only time she turned her back on me for
to the skating rink I had to reapply my wig um, because we're gonna go to Sunday fun day after this at least me and Serena is so got the girls with me Katana and Carrie back there so yeah we're about to head out I'll pick you guys up once we get there Bye. we finally made it to the skating rink it is hot as hell Oh my God. However, I asked for this heat <laughs> because it's been so cold. But yeah. See y'all when we get in.
we're back home. The girls are walking the dog. Um, taking Dior for his little walk. I am just now eating. And I'm actually getting sleepy. So I'm going to actually get up and get to moving around so I can get dressed for Sunday fun day. I don't have the slightest clue about what the hell I'm about to wear. Um, it's actually really hot outside. I don't know if that's going to change later um, on tonight. But I do plan on coming back home at a decent time tonight because I need to go to the gym in the morning. Okay, we getting back to our 4.30 wake ups. Okay, our 5 a.m. mornings at the gym. We getting back to that. So anyway, I'm gonna put this down, put my makeup on, and I'm not doing too much makeup either. Like, I'm not doing all that. With makeup, I'm not gonna do much because I look so tired because man, I got no sleep last night. Um, I woke up super early. But I got some shit done, so proud of myself for that. Uh, I actually went to virtual church this morning. So, yeah, let me lay down for like five, five minutes. And then I'm going to get up and start moving around so I can get dressed and get out the door. Oh, my God, I'm so tired. I don't want to go, but I'll pick you guys back up in a few. Bye. I ate it. <laughs> to the Sunday fun day event at Lava. Bro, it took me forever to find parking, but it's what I have on. I'll show you my fit later, but yeah, y'all. And I got a little ways to walk because this bitch is thick. Okay, almost thicker than me. Which you know, that's impossible, okay? But anyway, let me head up in here, pick y'all back up in a minute. This whole jumping tonight. exhausted i did not make it to the gym this morning so i will be going to the gym later today after work and then i'm gonna also go grab some groceries make dinner and yeah so i'm about to just go ahead and go to work and finish that up and start editing this vlog 
So, Lord, if the Lord's willing, <laughs> I can get this uploaded by Wednesday. Um, so, yeah, I hope you guys have been having a great week. Um, I've been hella busy, so, yeah. But anyway, let me get up, get my day started, get it going, get it over with. And I'll pick you guys back up maybe when I'm... Uh, Heading to the gym or something. I just, man, it's going to be packed. I probably just go super late um, today. So that way it's not as many people in there when I do go. So I don't know. I'll figure that part out. But I'll pick you guys back up then. Peace. Y'all, so for lunch, I ordered me some African cuisine. Um, I have some jollof rice, salmon, and a salad here. And some plantain, so we about to get a cracking, you hear me? It's like one in the afternoon. Um, the eclipse has happened. Um, my food just got delivered, so we're gonna see how this tastes. Mmm, stamina is okay. Jollof rice is good. What is Sally giving? Mmm. Plantains. I'm gonna go finish my meeting and my food. Pick you guys up later. Bye. All right, guys, I have taken me a very quick cat nap. I'm back up, about to go grocery shopping. I'm dressed for the gym as well. I ain't gonna lie, I'm very tired. I don't know if I'm gonna make it to the gym tonight, but I'm dressed just in case I can get out there and at least, bare minimum, do 30 minutes. But I'm about to go get some groceries and come back. Definitely, definitely, I'm not cooking. It's not happening. Um, so, we're going to cook tomorrow. But anyway, let me hurry up and get out of this house. It's already after 7. So, yeah, I'll pick you guys back up in a moment. Honey, play, 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 Look, I see the boots change. You can hear when I step, step, step. All the Chevy and painted in red. Money long, it can't fit in the bed. It don't matter what nobody says. Cut your boy to the day that I'm dead. You won't smoke on the Marlboro, man. Cut it out for it, get out of hand. This ain't Calabas. Tell me how it is. We take back, girl. Never been riding, baby. Step in that stirrup, hop on my saddle. Snake on my feet, they rattle. In the bag, only thing getting last year. And I'm still going up like a ladder. And I'm still in the field like cat. Cadillac back on the road. We take your room for the floor. Say what you need from the store. Oh, oh. Put some bits on my stove. She fit cornbread, booty corn fed. Body rolls at the road. And you're welcome at home. Ooh, ooh. Ride it through. Just to put my eyes on you. You are the superstar. Everybody driving no new cars. Turn a bad night to a good time on a trail ride to the side of I'm coming home. I'm coming home. Everything we kind of grabbed so far from Kroger's. We still have so much stuff to go get tomorrow. I'm going to go to Trader Joe's. And I need to go to Walmart and get some paper towels and stuff like that. So, we'll do it tomorrow. Um, but the main thing is, I'm gonna try this. This is new pineapple, zero sugar. So I'm gonna try that one. I typically get the mango. 
and the lemonade and I make my little concoction. I'll show you guys that probably in the next vlog or something, I don't know. But yeah, this is pretty much what we got for tonight. So yeah, we're about to put these things away and I need to get to the gym, bye. All right, y'all, so I just made it to the gym. It's fucking raining. Like it's lightning, thundering, and all of that. So <laughs> I'm like, damn, what's the sign I'm supposed to be staying at home? Okay. But anyway, I haven't been in the gym in man, damn, probably almost a month. But anyway, we getting back on track. We getting back in our routine. So let's go in here and get a little quick workout. I'm only gonna do about 30 minutes, 35 minute workout today. I need to get my body back acclimated to working out, so I'm not gonna go crazy today. So we're gonna take it real light, do something real slight, maybe do a walk on the treadmill, ride the bike. I don't know yet, but we're gonna see. See you inside. Bye guys. Switches, candy, apple, green, candy, paint, swirling 24 inch spinners. Swirl. Don't judge me, baby. <laughs> you would never judge me, baby. Uh -huh. Bottle in my hand, my whiskey up high. Two hands to heaven, coyotes run wild. Oh, oh, oh. God only, God only knows why, though. Why, why? Ten thousand steps towards the time of your life Two hands to heaven, my whiskey up high oh, oh, God only, God only knows why though Why though Two hands to heaven, I pray priests forgive my soul Lovely daggers kissed my heart many moons ago Toxic roses chased by wolves and carnivores with broken wings and we'll regrow. I'm almost tired and running, no candle in the wind. You won't ever see me coming or going, but you'll know whenever I'm here. Dancing in the moonlight, catching every breeze. My feet on the dashboard, and I go really fast, boy. Ever since I went to my car, ain't no trouble on my mind. Singing sweet songs to my Vegas, singing I will carry on, carry on, carry on, carry on, carry on. Singing, I will carry on. Ten thousand steps towards the time of your life. Two hands to heaven, my whiskey up high. Oh, oh, oh. God only, God only knows why, though. Why, why? Rhinestones and diamonds both shine in the light. Two hands to heaven, coyotes run wild. Oh, God only, God only knows why. Over this 
hips You grip like grind Then taste this wine I'ma taste what's mine Cause I'ma take what's mine Wonder whatever, wherever's fine Like water Wherever you wanna go, that's fine with me I'll never stop you you never stop me From being whatever we need to be And in these dark times I'm so glad that this love is blinding Cause all I see is the best in you And all you see is the best in me Can you bring out the best of me? And all I see is everything your goals, your goals, your kind of thing And how big a meaning So let's do this in these sheets, yeah I wanna get up to walk, I wanna feel weak, yeah But I ain't going far, so stay where you are You make like your party in Venus, and we woke up in Mars guys we did it we went to the gym today oh my god and it did stop raining and thundering like this whole storm has passed so that's a good thing uh but we're gonna go home we're gonna go eat i know it's super late like i'm should i should not be eating but i need to get some protein in me um after that little mile workout or whatever um and then we're gonna be right back at this at 5 a.m in the morning we're getting up at 4 maybe 4 30 4 15 i may need to get up at 4 15 because um child if i'm not in the gym by five it's gonna be a problem so yeah um we're gonna go home but yeah the workout was pretty good though i think i um i could have did a little more but i am a little sore from skating the other day and a all of that walking and standing um after skating really got me like really sore like crazy i haven't skated skated in like over a year um so yeah we're gonna get back to doing that i think i'm gonna surprise the girls with um their own skate soon i don't know and then maybe i need first i need to find a park where we can go skate um nearby and do that but yeah had a great workout um but tomorrow is on we're gonna step it up a notch we're gonna go ahead and add the weights back in the morning um i may not film tomorrow's workout because honestly that was a lot like setting up but i didn't record until after my workout so if that makes sense so i didn't record during my workout i did my 30 minutes and then i started to film after that because I can't be pausing in between my workouts, letting my body cool down. It's not good. So I did my recording after I completed my full workout. So that's probably what I do tomorrow if I film anything. But I'll probably holler at you guys in the morning. I think I'm just going to call it a night. Peace. Good morning, y'all. As you can see, I feel... A little bit more refreshed today rested today as opposed to yesterday i did not do my 4 a.m workout man i was exhausted i woke up at four and was like nah if i don't get to bed no later than 10 30 11 11 is the latest but even then i'm still like rishi washi on going to the gym after that at four getting up at four to go work out I don't like to go exhausted. That defeats the purpose of going to work out. And also your body need proper rest to do what you needed to do as far as working out goes. So yeah, I didn't go work out. Yeah, we didn't do none of that. Um, all I'm about to do now is go to work. I'm already dressed for the gym this morning. You guys can see this is what I'm gonna wear tonight to the gym. When I get off work, I do have a few errands to run. I still need to maybe go to Trader Joe's and I need to go to Walmart to pick up some um, household supplies and things like that. I don't know yet, but 
Yeah, and then we're gonna make dinner tonight. Um, <laughs> the girls ate pizza last night. I was like, no, it was so late. Um, I would have been in here cooking all night. Would have never got to the gym either. Like, um, so they ate pizza last night. And this morning, I'm just gonna give me like a little drinky drink and a banana, and that's gonna be my breakfast. So, yeah. And I always put my drinks in a glass. Just to make me feel like I'm doing something. Hey. So today I'm gonna drink some. Um, today we're gonna drink some naked. Um, I'm gonna have the. Hmm. Should I do the blue machine or the green machine? Of course, it may not be the healthiest thing, but it's not the worst thing compared to. Some of the things I could be eating this morning. So I don't know if I want to do the blue machine or the green machine. Hmm. Let me see. I think I may go with this one this morning. But then again, well, they both got bananas in it. So I'm going to go with the green machine. I need a little bit more energy today, so we're gonna go with that one this morning. And yeah, so we're gonna pour it up. I can shake it up because you know all of the good stuff be sinking to the bottom. So we're having this morning. I don't just pull the banana off. I actually cut the stem here. I normally do it with scissors, but there. I just cut it there because when you take the whole stem off, and you can see it's wrapped here, it makes them go bad way quicker. So we're gonna have a banana and green juice this morning for breakfast, so. Yeah, so I'm gonna do that. So let's try it. I mean, I know how it tastes, but cheers, guys. Here's to a great start. It's Taco Tuesday. Should I make tacos today? Or some sort of rendition of a taco or something? I don't know, maybe I'll do something like that. I don't know if people still do Taco Tuesday, but we're gonna do it over here, maybe, I don't know. So good. All right, guys. Peace out. I'll pick you guys up later. Bye. All right, guys. So I decided to make some baked potatoes instead. I got three to be exact. I got to make some stuffed baked potatoes. And I don't know if I want to add something to this or not. But that's what we're going to have for dinner tonight instead. So that they don't go bad. I was going to do tacos. And quite frankly, I'm not going to make it to the grocery store today anyway because it's super late i'm gonna go to the gym come back well i'm gonna grab what i need come back and then finish the cooking but i'm gonna go ahead and put these on now before i go to the gym so while i'm there they are cooking when i get back they can be pretty much almost done so we're gonna get started with that now i'm just gonna wash these off first
Let's go. I'm about to go to the gym. take you guys in the store i think i'm just a little bit in the gym not much but you guys kind of saw what i did yesterday i pretty much did the same thing tonight which was about 30 minutes on the bike um just to get myself back in the groove of things i wanted to do weights but since i'm cooking super late i was in a rush to get back home to do that so yeah i'm about to go ahead and start prepping this meal so let's get into it I got in the end, that's what I found out. 
right, y'all. So here's the moment of truth. Let's see. Carry your lunch is ready. <laughs> What what's the verdict? What's the verdict? It's good. Ten, ten out of ten. Ten out of ten recommend. All right, I'm gonna go over there and eat my food, y'all. Get, get away from that. You get on my nerves trying to eat everything. Move. All right, y'all. That concludes this. And action. All right, guys. That concludes this week's vlog. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe if you're not already a part of the family. I am going to be doing another try-on haul. It was supposed to be posted Sunday. However, my last order is delayed. So one of my things arrived today. So it may be going up sometime next week. So be on the lookout for that. But until then, be sure to check out all of my other vlogs that's already posted. And I'm going to be posting another vlog sometime maybe later this week. So stay tuned. Turn your notification bells on. Thank you guys so much for your support. And we're on our way to 1K subscribers. There will be a giveaway for that. Stay tuned for details to come in the next vlog on how to enter that giveaway. Thank you guys so much. Peace.